I mean, check this out. This is so amazing. What is happening? Oh my god, that is awesome. Hey, what's up my fellow twisters? Welcome back to another redstone map showcase. Today, we are taking a look at a super awesome redstone room switcher that basically transforms a cave into a wonderfully decorated house. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. This map itself is quite old, but I'll link the original video down below because I still think it stands the test of time. I mean, this is absolutely awesome. And as you can see, it uses a lot of of redstone. All right, so you could use world edits or MC edits in order to add this into a regular Minecraft cave and kind of blend it in more into the environment. But this is basically the entrance to the tunnel. As you can see, it leads into a cave that is filled with ores and whatnot, and everything looks pretty normal, but it is not normal. There is a lot of stuff that's going to happen. All right, so now I'm going to activate the system. The only way to activate the system that I know of is to activate this bud switch, which is basically a block update switch and we're gonna do that right now all right so i'm gonna use a uh, regular torch over here place it down and then activate that bud switch quickly change into spectator mode come back into the cave as you can see the cave is now changing oh my goodness the ceilings the floor the wall i mean check this out this is so amazing what is happening oh my god that is awesome Oh, geez, it's not even finished yet. I mean, look, it pops up the tables, all of the, uh, you know, beds, crafting tables. We have chests and whatnot, and it's super cool as well as it does have, like, a new entrance or en exit, I guess you would say, on the other side of the map. We have an enchantment table over here with some bookcases and whatnot, and I mean, gosh, that is so freaking cool. I mean, this is absolutely mind-blowing and a pretty cool redstone map, I do have to say. Now, to turn this off, there's actually a reset button on the outside, but I'm not gonna do that and this map actually works best on uh, 1.7 because there's a few like blocks missing and whatnot in 1.8 which kind of makes the map look a bit weird all right so actually you know what i'm gonna go outside and try to reactivate the system i'm not sure if it's going to uh, properly transform it back into a cave because i've only ever tested this in 1.7 well, let's just uh, try it out. Okay, so I'm gonna just change back into spectator mode and go back into the cave. And look at this, guys. It's transforming itself back into a cave from a room. That is so freaking insane. Now, the main reason I actually showed this in 1.8 is because of spectator mode that way i could be inside of the cave while it's happening but as you can see there is a bit of a glitch in 1.8 where it keeps this wall uh as the decoration because as you can see when it was activated there was the regular smooth stone but when it's deactivated you can see that the, this these blocks stay here for some reason so yeah that is one of the downsides in 1.8 but in 1.7 we don't have that issue but yet again the only reason that i did not show it in 1.7 is because i need spectator mode in order to like quickly go down here but uh yeah that is pretty much the map i mean it's pretty insane even though we have this small glitch over here on the side and you could continuously activate this and reactivate it which is like super cool and i could also actually break that block over there i'm not sure if that's going to mess up the map but as you can see um we do fall down if we are standing on here which is uh, pretty unfortunate but yet again the map is really awesome it's just really cool to see a room transform from a cave into just this wonderfully decorated house i mean this is so freaking cool so anyways guys that is basically going to wrap up today's redstone map showcase it was a pretty short video but it includes some awesome redstone i mean look at this we even have working redstone lamps in the ceilings that is so freaking mind-blowing now i'll try to include a download link in the description box down below i will host it on my own forms page because the map creator actually doesn't have this download up on his video and that is kind of weird but i did find it scouring internet and uh yes i'll try to include that so if the map creator sees this i am really sorry for not including your forms if there is one but i cannot actually find it but you guys should definitely go check out the original video because he does deserve a lot of credit for creating this really incredible map anyways guys this was twist you can subscribe to see more awesome redstone maps tutorials and a lot more but anyways i'll see you guys next time